my loves how are we all doing if you're new here my name is Vic and if you're coming back hello my friends how are we all doing so today I just thought I'd show you what I picked up on Black Friday Um, I got quite a few bits of Beauty Bear I got a couple of bits of Morphe I also picked you guys up a palette for um, the December giveaway but I will warn you if you order anything off Morphe this has taken about four weeks to come it's really has took taking the mix to be honest i didn't think i was going to get it um morphe i don't know what's going on with them because usually they're really good but they aren't even they, i had to open a case with paypal to get this um and magically within like two days of me opening the paypal case i had tracking hmm coincidence no coincidence i think not so yeah i bought you guys one i also had to obviously buy myself one so um i'll show you mine obviously you guys will get one with that haven't been touched and haven't been swatched but it is the nikita dragon morphe palette and um, retails for 30 pound but I, obviously i got a deal i got bound and get one free but if you guys was gonna buy this you would um pay 30 pound i don't know if it's picking up on the screen but it's like a multi, a multi um purpley blue here it just looks like a really cool eyeshadow palette we've got a a, a multi uh, chrome a multi press glitter here so yeah i'll do some swatches and then you guys can see um what will be in the giveaway so so far in the december's giveaway which will be coming up soon yeah, be drawing that soon will be the morphe palette the uh you can be eyeshadow palette and then we've got um a bronzer we've got some shower gel we've got a, a mascara we've got loads of lip creams we've got all that going in there plus we're gonna have a lot more going in because i have got one two three four five six seven um boxes to go through plus i've also got coming um i bought two of the uh glossy box and mystery boxes so they're coming they haven't come yet but uh yeah so there'll be miles more stuff going in here so i'm just so excited so anyway guys let me do some swatches so i thought i would do a, a look using this but i'm going to do it next week because i ain't got time this week i've got that many unboxings to do so yeah let's do some of the mattes so we'll do escort which is like this gorgeous champagne goldy color we've got 703 let's do that weird metamorphous shade which is like a purpley like when you rub it together it's like a, a bluey purpley color and we'll do kitana because that looks nice as well some of these are like a duochrome topper right guys so this one is escort it's really pretty then we've got like the weird multi-chrome one which is like the metamorphous shade that is really pretty as well and then next to that is like a duo chrome thank you tea service yay <laughs> um so yeah we've got like the duo chrome one there and then next to that we've got 703 wow that 703 is pigmented so yeah um that's a couple of the shimmers let's do this full fantasy one as well because that's like a weird pattern duo chrome and that's like a really cool smoky one there and then we've got um a load of cool uh really unusual uh mattes going on so we've got like this really nice bright like neon green color which is nice so that one's there oh they're so pretty pretty um and then let's do like the really cool um pink which is uh, obviously called Nikita and then we will do a blue which because blues are quite hard to formulate <sighs> some of them are going on a little bit patchy but like I say swatches me absolutely jack shit and uh, obviously let's do the press glitter because I like to ruin my life so yeah we'll just do oh actually came on my finger so easily I don't know how well you can see that but that is so nice and stuck perfectly look Oh, well, you can see that. It's so, so pretty. Can you see that now? Yeah, boy. Really nice. So, yeah, guys, one of you guys will win that in the December giveaway. I will link that linked up here now. So, if you want to go and enter that, pause this video, get your bum over there, go and watch that. you got to watch it all the way through, guys, because you can't just enter it. you got to know what to say to enter. 
and you've got to know the rules. Grab yourself a little drinky poos. Oh, Jesus, that's all in the sun. And let's get into the rest of this stuff. So, yeah. So that looks like a really nice palette, that. Um, like I said before, Morphe can be pretty hit and miss. I don't know what it's like to put it on my eyeballs. But it's got really good reviews. So, yeah, I'm excited to put this on my eyes. And I'm excited. Whoever wins the December uh, giveaway would be really cool if you could do a look and then post it on Instagram or if you're brave enough put it on YouTube that'd be cool so we can see what you come up with can't get it back in the box we'll do that later so yeah guys so the first thing I picked up this is wasn't from uh, Beauty Bay this was from um, Amazon I really liked them my sister got my daughter the set and like unicorn brushes and they're just so cute look at them and there was like really reasonable price she got one, two, three, four, five face brush it, brushes and five eyeshadow brushes. I mean, look at those. How nice are those? And they feel really decently heavy quality. And, yeah, so I picked these up. These were £8 and you got the case. If anyone's interested in getting the uh, your hands on these, I will leave it linked down below. But, yeah, really, really nice. And that is the first thing on Black Friday that I picked up. The next things that I picked up was um, when I found them. These wasn't really discounted heavily, but the, to be honest, these are already discounted. So, you know, when I did the Essence haul and I got the Love, um, Love Eyeshadow Palette, well, I went back and got the Power Eyeshadow Palette, um, Daily Dose of Power, which is like the blue one. So, I haven't used that yet, but yeah, uh, picked that up. And I also picked up another couple of the lipsticks because um, I was like impressed with them. So, yeah, I picked up a couple more of those. So yeah, that's what I picked up from Essence. So now we will go through what I got from uh, Beauty Bear. I mean, I wanted to go crazy. I know a lot of the big brands had like massive Black Friday event, but I had to bring myself in somewhere. So I picked up um, this highlighting brush because I've only got one and I really did need, well, I didn't really need it, but I wanted, I'll rephrase that, I wanted another one. And this looked like really good quality and it feels lovely. And it's got like the B, I don't know if you can see that. Can you see like the B logo on there? Um, and it looks really, really pretty. In fact, let me just grab my highlight and we'll see how it applies. I haven't got a mirror. Let's just, uh, this is a lot bigger than what I'm used to. Ooh, ooh. I'm using my camera on my, my screen on my camera so I look like the Tin Man. Ain't my fault because I can't see what I'm doing. But yeah, that's the best thing. Really, really nice. Um, all of these are really affordable and I'm sure some of this stuff's still available. I don't think it will be as cheap as what I got it for though because I got all this stuff. Hang on, I'll tell you what I paid for that. I paid £3 for that. So that is a bargain, isn't it? It is a bargain. The, I got a couple of palettes. I wanted to try... Um, the their brand um this is their pastels palette and this cost me a grand old total of six pound so i got the pastels palette oh, i'm opening it the wrong way which looks like this really pretty packaging i've already checked all this as so no it's not broken because there's not got not going to be anything worse than opening a broken palette like, um when you're recording so yeah this is the pastel palette it's all mattes and it just looked really pretty and it was only six pounds and to go with that i picked up the eye base the white eye base so what i'll do is i'll put some of this white eye base down on my hand obviously you wouldn't let me do it both anyway i'm going to put some white eye base down and then i'm going to swatch one with the eye base and then one with the knot so this is like the obviously the white eye base because I don't have a white eye base, so I thought I would pick one up. So I've just put like a swatch, I don't know if you can see that on my arm. I don't know if you need to let it dry or not. Yeah, so I'll let that just tack down a bit and I'll do the um, swatches underneath normally and then we'll go over the top on top with that one so first we've got cold oh they do feel really nice as well um cold free then we've got euphoria 
shifters and first light and they do feel really nice I've got to admit I mean pastels obviously in my opinion you do need to have some sort of base down because you're not going to be able to see them much that's it without the um, lights are like washing it out a lot that's it without the base so let's, now let's go on top of the base So obviously a lot more pigmented when we've got the base down there. <sighs> yeah, you need a base for these guys. If you're going to get this eyeshadow palette, I would recommend their white base because it has really done a lot. Or any base to be honest, but if you're going to get a base, I would recommend if you're using something like a pastel. <sighs> I mean, look at that. I can really tell the difference, it's a lot more. Just let me just uh, turn this light off because I think it's washing it out a bit. You can see that now. The light is just crazy, can you see the difference? That's madness. Anyway, so yeah, I really like that. So I'm going to have a play about with that. If you want to see a video on any of these eyeshadow palettes, let me know in the comments and I shall make one. Um. I don't think I've really done a full uh, pastels eyeshadow look. And I have to, I've, had, I've had the Blooming Up um, Pastels palette, didn't I? But to be honest, that looks a lot better with that white base down. It's like really brought those shadows to life. So yeah, that's the first palette I got from um, Beauty Glaze. Just let me... Right guys, um, I'll just bring it out in order whatever I pick up first. So the second thing I picked up from them was the Ticket to Brazil Wet n Wild Bronzer. Um, so let me just open this up. It looks like this. Uh, this retailed for... Where would you be? Um, can't seem to find it. Uh £2.25 I got this for, so again, bargain price. I know Wet n Wild's pretty reasonably priced anyway, but I mean, big big bare pan of bronzer for like two quid is, is crazy to me. Do you know what I mean? So, right, let me get this done. Okay, so that's the bronzer. It's got a really pretty pattern on. And let's swatch it. Oh, that is so, so pretty. don't know if you can see that. It's like a shimmery bronzer. Let me just go over the top that's really really nice I reckon that look really really pretty um so that's the next thing I've got in there one thing I will say about Beauty Bay is it usually comes the next day and it's usually really quick and always really well uh, packed so the next thing I picked up was uh, the Jeffree Star um, in lipstick in Posh Spice now I usually get I Am Nude but I've been after this one for ages and it was in the sale and it was £9.60 these are usually £16 each so I got a really good deal on it I wish I could have got some of the other ones for £9.60 put it that way so that's the shade just like a really pretty cool tone um, nude and I love Jeffree's formula at the sale put all night um, and to be honest Although £16 does seem like a lot for a liquid lip, they are worth it to me. So, to get it for £9, I was like, give me it here. Bring it this way. So, the next thing I got is, again, was because I wanted to test more beauty based stuff. I'm going to try and get a full face together. So, uh, next time I'm going to try and get their foundation stuff. It might not be quite a full face, but we're going to try and do mostly a full face of beauty base. So, this is their highlighter. Again, I like the packaging, very simplistic. This was £3. Or was it £3.25? So that's the packaging. Again, really, really pretty. Yeah, £3.25 it was. Look at that. It's really nice. That is really, 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 look. 
don't know where you can see that, but oh my god, that is pretty. I don't know where you can see that, but it's just there. So, so pretty. Anyway, yeah, so that's the next thing that I picked up. Uh, the obviously I bought the um, the eye base which was six pounds. Uh, I think it's usually nine pound and I got it for six, so that was the next thing. And that looked really good when I had it on my hand. Uh, the next thing that I picked up from Beauty Bear was a powder blusher, and this was three pound sixty. Yeah, £3.60. And again, it's in the really cool packaging. And the same as the uh, highlighter, you've got really pretty blusher. I'm hoping it's not like massively pigmented, but it's like a glowy blush, which is there. And it looks really, really pretty right up my alley. So that's the next thing that I picked up. Like I say, I wanted to go crazy, but I'm trying to like rein myself in from buying too much stuff. Because I don't need it, and I've already got loads loads of stuff but I just thought this was too good to um to, to miss to be honest so this is the last thing that I picked up from them and it is their book of magic eyeshadow palette this cost me uh nine pound and I just thought I need it I need it in my life it just looks so so pretty and it's the only one that had five star reviews and everyone seemed to love it so this is the outside of the palette it looks really really and it's really good weight as well it's really good quality. It's tw 20, um, 20 pan eyeshadow palette and I just needed it in my life. It was either that or I get the Jeffree Star one, but that was like, even when, I, when it was discounted, it was still like 39 quid and I was like, nah. Just can't justify it right now. So let's do some swatcheroonies with this bad boy. Um... So make sure my hand is clean. So I've got glitter all over my arm from the air, uh, the glitter. So let's do some mattes first. So we've got Amulet, uh, Enchanted, which is like a lilac purple colour. We shall do Wish, which is like a teal colour. Uh, we shall do Sorcery. They do feel really really good we shall do uh, voodoo and we shall do still a couple of the blues so we do um bewitched cursed and trick So that's the mattes swatched out. Some of them are a little bit patchy, but like I say, you can't really tell until you've got them on your eyeballs, what they're going to be like. Um, and, you know, I've had eyeshadow palettes before, they've swatched amazing on my hand, and then on the eye, they've just looked either all the same colour or they've just been crap. So you don't know until you get it on the eye, but like I say, this was the only one that had all those uh, good reviews. So let's do some shimmeroos. So we've got stuff. Oh, these feel beautiful. I feel like butter and the swatching already. I can just tell. It's gonna tell they're gonna be good. So we've got Stardust Alchemy. Let's do like this duochrome crystal colour. It's like a topper. That's so beautiful. And uh, we will do let's do all the shimmers because they just look so pretty, don't they? They do. Ooh. just be careful because that has stained my finger that it will be because it's a pressed pigment and not an eyeshadow but to be honest that never usually bothers me but if it bothers you it's maybe not going to be the palette for you but I always use um, I always use an eye base anyway so oh, some of these are beautiful You know me and my shimmers. You know me and my shimmers. Oh, there we go. So there's the beautiful, beautiful. Ooh. 
stunning beautiful if i could let you feel it through the camera i would because that is beautiful yeah guys so that's it i'm really really impressed with them um, especially this palette this has to be my favorite thing of all oh and the and the um the brushes so um yeah that's it guys for this video so if if you're not already subscribed my loves hit the subscribe button ring the notification bell so that you will be informed of all my future uploads remember to enter december's giveaway you've still got a bit of time left i believe let me just double check so i don't give you the wrong information i think i was running it till the 19th or was it the 12th i think it's this uh, saturday the 12th when it when it ends so you know if you need if you want to have a chance to win and people do you know people at least expect it do win so get yourself down there make sure that if you do enter you check to see if you've won because you know people are getting back to me who've won so make sure you do and uh, yeah I've got another three or four videos to film so I'm gonna love you and leave you now I love you so love you so, so much darlings bye for now and take care bye